Hello everybody, welcome back to Miranda Detailing where we make satisfying detailing videos. In today's video, we're looking at two APC cleaners from Extreme Solutions. So Extreme Solutions has a variety of products, but the two of them that we've been using on the interior and exterior of the vehicle, especially the interior, has been their Tsunami Specialty Cleaner and their BioClean. Now these are both APCs, or all-purpose cleaners and degreasers. Their Tsunami Specialty Cleaner is a newer product of theirs that they came out with. It is designed as a degreaser, as an all-purpose cleaner, and depending on the dilution ratio, you can use it on the exterior for degreasing and cleaning and traffic film removal, APC rinsing, using on your wheels, tires, wheel wells, or you can use it as an interior cleaner if diluted again properly, one to 10, one to five, to whatever dilution ratio that you want. This is an amazing cleaner. I'm really, really happy with it, and it works very well. These products do what they're supposed to do. Now, the BioClean, is again an APC cleaner and degreaser. Now, if you want an APC cleaner that is a little bit more environmentally friendly, that's up to you. This would be a great choice uh, because it's still a very strong cleaner, but it has different ingredients than some of the other APC and degreaser cleaners. But both of these products work really, really well. So we're gonna use it on the interior of this vehicle and it's pretty trashed. The seats are gross, the carpets are gross, and we're gonna show you the full process of what we did. Cleaning these seats, scrubbing them, drill brushing them, extracting them, steaming them, the work. And we're using these cleaners and they work really, really well. This Chevy Cobalt was in bad shape. The fabric seats had horrible stains from drink spills and other stuff, and they needed a deep cleaning. Plus, this fabric is not always the easiest to clean. Sometimes it cleans up great, depending on the stains, other times not so much. We never know until we start the process. The seats also had some wear and tear and you could tell that the cushions underneath the seat fabric were also worn down. So as we clean, we don't want to be too aggressive. We start with a thorough vacuuming to get all the dry stuff first. Next, we spray a generous amount of the Extreme Solutions Tsunami Cleaner, and this was diluted 4 to 1 for heavy cleaning. Next, we use a drill brush to agitate, but we don't put any pressure so as not to harm the already worn fabric. This does help to break up the stains and helps with the extraction process later. You can already see a huge difference. Next, we steam it heavily, and I make sure to wrap the head of the steamer with a microfiber towel so that the bristles don't damage the fabric. This again aids in breaking up the dirt and grime. Finally, we extract. Now we don't always do this because we can run into other issues with stains drying up or wicking, but in this case, it worked out really well. You can see that it's not really extracting much from the seats. That's because the majority of dirt and grime was already dissolved and transferred into the microfiber towels when we steamed. That's why extracting is not always necessary. Just use common sense and reasonableness when assessing each detail and your process. Now I know you want to get your hands on this clear head nozzle, but unfortunately, this nozzle with the internal sprayer I'm using for my Mighty Light 2 8070 is currently unavailable at this time on both Amazon and eBay, and I'm not sure why. But if you want to grab other clear head extractor nozzles, I'll have them linked down below along with other tools and products that we use on a regular basis. So using a dry microfiber towel, I wipe the fabric seat down to even out any moisture and to check to see if the stains were removed and if anything transfers onto the towel. So now I'm going to use Extreme Solutions BioClean on the back of the seat. Now this cleaner was also diluted four to one, 
It's designed as a more environmentally friendly product, but don't be fooled by that. It's very strong and it works extremely well. Also, those lines are not stains or marks on the fabric. They're caused by the lights in our garage. Let's move over to the passenger side seats. I'm using Turtle Wax Interior One Foaming Cleaner to see how well it performs on these nasty seats. This version is also boosted with Oxy, so it's really strong. It's a thick foam that has a nice even spray pattern. I cover their entire seat, and then slowly use the drill brush to agitate the cleaner into the fabric. I didn't want to start the drill and sling the foam everywhere, so I decided to spread the product around with my hands instead. Then, when it was worked in, I used the drill brush to agitate further. Even though this product was designed to use without an extractor, I went through the same process to see if it would make a difference to steam and extract. Again, it's not always necessary to use an extractor. As you can see, it didn't do much. So the cleaner did an incredible job at dissolving and removing those stains. What's, What's up, mister? mister? If you want to simply apply this turtle wax foaming cleaner without using a steamer or an extractor, you could. It will dry and leave the fabric clean and fresh. That's up to you and how bad the stains are. After the extraction process, we use a microfiber towel to even out the moisture so the fabric dries without any spots or uneven areas. Now there are many different ways to clean, polish, and protect your vehicle inside and out. True, there are some practices that are definitely wrong, but again, common sense and reasonableness will guide you in that process. If you've dialed in a process that works for you, and not only are you getting great results but making your customers happy, then go for it. It's not perfect, but it's a huge improvement.
that's it guys, the vehicle cleaned up really, really well. Again, there's only so far you can go on a vehicle like that that has just been trash. And some stains, some spots are not going to be removed no matter what you do. However, the overall effect, dramatic. Huge turnaround and we used these cleaners along with a few other ones because we're always testing out uh, different products. But these cleaners did really well in cleaning up those carpets and the upholstery and any of the plastic and interior components it cleans very well. So it doesn't leave any type of residue that I can see, especially on the plastics or anything like that. Some cheap cleaners will leave kind of like a, a nasty residue on interior leather and plastic components. So these do not do that at all. They rinse very well. If you take a damp towel and you go over that area that you just cleaned and kind of give it a rinse and a wipe over, then it removes any type of residual residue that most APC or degreasers have anyway, and it cleans up beautifully. So I really recommend these cleaners. They worked well for me. Now, you can also use this on the exterior. I haven't had a chance to use it on the exterior yet, but if you dilute it a little bit stronger, then it can be used as a wheel, tire cleaner, traffic foam remover, cleaning up the engine and any of those nasty parts, this stuff will clean up really, really well. So guys, if you wanna pick up these products, check out the links down below, go to the website, Extreme Solutions, and give some of these products a try. They have a variety of different products, but I chose these ones. I actually wanted to try their APCs, their BioClean and their Tsunami Cleaner. And uh, so far, I'm really liking these products. Now, another cool thing that Extreme Solutions does, which I'm really happy about, is they provide really nice screen printed bottles and really nice labels. So you have the screen printed Extreme Solutions logo here. And then there's a space in the back where you can also get the labels, the proper labeling for each product with everything on there. Now, I really appreciate that. You know I'm a fan of labeled bottles. Check out the video uh, that I have in the card uh, showing all the different labeled bottles. Meguiar's does a great job at that also. But when Extreme Solutions reached out to me, um, this was something that I specifically mentioned is do they have bottles with their product labels and information? So what they do is they print it on sheets like this. So one sheet can get you six bottles. So if the label starts to get grungy, you can peel it off and put a new one or put one right on top of that. But so far I've had these for weeks now and yeah, they're really holding up well. They're not peeling or cracking or getting damaged or anything like that. So they work awesome. I really appreciate that. So secondary bottles, secondary labels, I'm a huge fan of and they provide that for you. So guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, like it, share it with others who may enjoy it or benefit from it, and definitely give some of these products a try. Again, I have links down below. And guys, consider subscribing if you haven't already and click that bell. That way you get notifications each time our videos drop each week and you don't miss stuff. So thank you for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Have a safe week. Take care.